In this tutorial I'll explain how to make a portrait in geometric style. I'll use a custom image to demonstrate the tutorial. It would be better if the image is simplified into a drawing, I'll do that using paintbrush tool. You can double click on the tool, and set its size and angle, according to your requirements. After the sketch is done, you can use pen, or other geometrical tools to draw the basic shapes of the body. I need symmetry in the face so I'll make half of the face and duplicate it, and then merge both sides by using Unite Shape on Pathfinder. You can draw body and cloths, using similar tools used for, hair, and face. To make a geometrical eye, Use the polygon tool and make an octagon. Use the eraser tool to cut lower half of the octagon, and then duplicate it. You can make eyelids by aligning the duplicate and using minus front, from Pathfinder. You can remove the edges of the eyeball by adding anchor points, on the intersects of eyelids, and then deleting the outermost anchor points. You can draw a half of geometrical nose by using pen tool and then duplicate and group them. Grouped items can be painted by using live paint bucket without having the need to join them. To make the upper lips, simply make a hexagon and transform it, then add a triangle, on its top, and use, minus front, from Pathfinder. You can make the lower lips by pen tool. If you want to join the duplicates you can select two corresponding points and then join them from path options.
to form color palettes for coloring. Make equally sized blocks and fill them with your desired color. To form a blend between shades, choose the blend tool and then choose the blocks you want the blend from. Make sure the blocks are not stroked, or else it would cause problem in the blend. You can separate the blend by adjusting spaces in blend option, and then expanding it. You can then add the expanded color blocks to your color swatches. If you prefer half shaded portrait, select the hair polygon and lock it. Then draw a line between the portrait. Now select this line and divide it from path options. Now you can add your required colors in divided portions. After you're done coloring, Select the whole portrait and remove the strokes. Your geometrical portrait is ready. Thank you for watching.